68 degrees. Winds are light out of the southwest at just six miles per hour. So very, very nice conditions across the region right now. Your high today hit 79 degrees, your low today 59. So temperatures pretty much where they should be for this time of year. The record of 92 is back in 1949, safe for another year. Same thing with that record low of 46. Sun's uh, coming up tomorrow morning at 537 and it's set today at 858. Looking at the radar. With mainly clear skies, you're not going to see any rain on the screen. High pressure in control across the eastern Great Lakes, bringing us pleasant conditions tonight. Abundant sunshine tomorrow, but that area of high pressure will start to drift off toward the east. And on Sunday, it'll be very warm and very humid and very unsettled. And we do have the threat for some severe storms on Sunday. So we get toward Sunday late afternoon and notice all of western New York shaded in that dark green. That means a marginal risk for severe storms. That's from the Storm Prediction Center. And the main threat with the storms on Sunday it could be strong damaging wind. So late on Sunday, we're going to watch things very closely across the region. 68 right now in Buffalo, 64 in Batavia, 68 in Niagara Falls, 65 in Jamestown. Olean coming in at 59 degrees. We head over toward Akron at 69, Oakfield at 68, Swarmville a mild 70 degrees, Lockport 69, Cambria 68. Now tomorrow afternoon in the North Towns, you'll find temperatures in the 80s, close to 90 degrees, 90 in Pendleton, 88 in Grand Island, 85 in Lancaster, 84 in Akron. This is the area where you're going to see a lot of folks participating in the ride for Roswell. Now the earlier riders, you're going to find temperatures in the low 60s, a comfortable start to the day around 7 a.m. But with that sun shining brightly, temperatures are going to warm up very quickly. Low 80s by 11 o'clock. And then tomorrow afternoon in Amherst at the UB North Campus, you're going to see temperatures in the upper 80s. So sunny and hot. So make sure you hydrate on the uh, bike ride tomorrow. Hour by hour forecast showing mainly clear skies tonight. Sunshine on Saturday. Sunday we start dry. Some scattered showers develop early Sunday afternoon. Then we'll see the storms pop up late Sunday afternoon in front of a cold front that's going to move through and really drop our temperatures as we head into Monday. Like I mentioned earlier, the main threat for these storms on Sunday will be the strong damaging winds and possibly some flooding if you get some of that heavy rain that kind of hangs out in one area. It is going to be quite warm tomorrow with temperatures in the upper 80s, close to 90 degrees. Lows in the 70s Saturday night, and then on Sunday we're in the mid to upper 80s early in the afternoon. Then that rain moves in and temperatures do drop just a bit. It'll be very, very muggy, especially as we get into late Saturday and Sunday. Then that front moves through and notice how comfortable it'll be as we head into Monday. Your forecast for tonight. Overnight lows in the low 60s, mainly clear and pleasant. Tomorrow, your high 88 degrees, mostly sunny and hot. Check out your seven day forecast and you're looking at temps in the mid to upper 80s on Sunday with those late day storms near 70 on Monday. Cooler and pleasant. Then we get to Tuesday 74 with sunshine.